All right, guys, have you ever wondered what it looks like on the inside of a foldable, specifically the Honor Magic V5? Now, I'm not someone who does a lot of teardowns, but you know, yesterday I actually went to the Honor Service Center, you know, just to see what's going on there. And they actually had the entire Magic V5 torn apart with all the components side by side. So I thought, why not take a quick look at it, you know, take some videos and show you guys what's actually happening on the inside. You know, after all, Honor has made all these claims about how durable the affordable actually is so maybe let's take a look at what's actually inside that makes it so strong let's go now first things first again it's worth mentioning that a lot of people these days you know whenever they think about buying affordable they're still quite concerned with how these things may hold up in fact i think i've seen one with green lines and that's also a big headache so anyways uh with these components here we can start off with my favorite part and that's of course the external display now for the external display what you see here is actually the anti-scratch nano crystal shield it's supposed to be super scratch and drop resistant and it's great for resisting sharp objects that you might be using on the daily like your keys your coins your knives and all that so obviously this is going to be strong enough to withstand anything that i throw at it with what i have today but i still wanted to do a very quick you know key scratch test with some pen knives and all that around and obviously the thing held up really well you will not get any scratches on the screen and it's still perfectly fine after using a lot of effort trying to scratch the display so that's happening on the outside but i thought on the inside you know this is where the things are most interesting because this is actually a pretty soft display so i saw the exact component here the inner display and the funny thing was you could actually fold it both you know like inwards but also backwards like you could totally go the other way around and it could still fall around because it's actually very flexible so again what's happening over here is you know we do have a three layer protective structure it starts with the outer layer that is alumina coated for anti-scratching and better scratch resistant now just so you know alumina is actually a very hard material that helps prevent scratches so you know that's basically on the outer layer now move deeper and you go into the middle layer and over here what we have is the non-newtonian fluid coating that's made to absorb impact from drops now moving on to the final part if you just flip it to the back notice at the back here uh, this is where you have the full carbon fiber backing near to the hinge and this actually helps to prevent dust and that's actually a very common issue for any kind of green line situation on the inner display anyway if you do happen to damage uh you know your displays both the outside or the inside within a single year honor is providing a one year free crack warranty that means that if your displays got cracked you can actually get it replaced for a small labor fee of 60 ringgit now if that's not enough there is also a two year you know warranty for any kind of damages obviously not caused by the user to the outside screen as well as the inside screen such as display leaking green lines and you know for any kind of situation where your display just isn't functioning properly you can actually walk into the honor service center and get that replaced free of charge any amount of times within two years so that's just to give you a bit of peace of mind for using the outside screen as well as the inner screen all right so other than the displays what i also saw here was actually a very close look at the back panel but on the inside now basically the back panel is made from this aerospace grade fiber it's supposed to be more impact resistant up to 40 times it's super high in strength heat resistant corrosion resistant and also more importantly very lightweight so you can actually see this very thin piece of back panel although it looks super slim but it's also made to protect the device so you know even if you drop your phones your phone would still be protected but my suggestion is you know try to use a case if you can now moving on what else we have here is actually the hinge so I think the hinge itself is actually a very interesting mechanism. You know, this has been something that Honor has worked on for many years now, since their first foldable and all that. So what we have here is actually called the Super Steel Hinge. It has better impact resistance and is tested for 500,000 folds. So that means no matter how many times you fold, you know, over multiple years, I think even more than a decade, the phone or the hinge itself will still hold up and be able to open and close smoothly without any issues. So other couple of notable items that we have here is also the 5820mAh carbon silicon battery. Now you can see that it's split into two pieces, one on the left, one on the right. So there's actually two pieces in there. And again, they are actually very, very slim. Hopefully other brands will follow what Honor is doing and also use these carbon silicon batteries because it just gives you more capacity and even slimmer packages. Furthermore, I also noticed there was quite a fair bit of cooling efforts being made to the entire chipset, the board itself. You know, sometimes when you use a foldable, you might be worried about how it's able to dissipate heat 
not. But in this case, there's quite a bit of efforts being made to keep the phone cool. Obviously, there were also the frames of the device which, you know, taken apart, it looks very, very thin. Now, last but not least, what we also have here is a couple of the sensors that you can find on the camera itself. You have the main sensor, you also have the telescope. You know, these pieces are actually so tiny. They look like little Lego pieces. And, you know, it's really fun to actually see all these components come together to form the entire device. You know, at the end of all this, you know, it's not every day that we actually get to see what's happening on the inside, have every major component stripped out for you to actually have a look and actually handle it so you know kudos to honor for actually having the confidence for us to actually check this out again you want to find out more details about the honor magic v5 you can check out my review as well as my hands-on and all that i've done before hopefully today's video has been a bit fun a bit different seeing things on the inside and i look forward to seeing you guys in the next one do take care stay safe and bye bye